G'day YouTube, today I'll show you error handling in Visual Basic 2008 or 2005. Now, error handling is when your application will handle an unhandled exception. Now, an unhandled exception is when, um, is like say, well, I'll give you an example. Here's a simple calculator. It will divide stuff, so say 70 divided by 2 is 35. And an unhandled exception is, say, 70 divided by y. And you can't divide 70 by y, so you'll confuse your application. See, conversion from string y to type double is not valid. And many software designers find this um, annoying, because then it makes your application look unprofessional-like. So um, today I'm going to show you two ways to overcome this problem. The first one is called try. Try statement provides a way to handle some or possible errors that might occur in a given block of code while still running the code. So that's what try does. So, and it will try to do textbox 3.txt equals textbox 1.txt divided by textbox 2.txt. And on error handling or catch x as exception, I will make it go message box invalid number so let's debug this and, and I'll try that again 70 divided by y button 1 calculate invalid number and another way to do this is another way that's uh, my personal favorite and I'll show you and it's called on error go to underscore handler so on error go to error handler and here we type error and underscore handler and, and I'll make it go message box invalid number oh. Okay, so let's debug this and try it again. 70 divided by y, button 1, invalid number. So thank you for watching our video on error handling in Visual Basic 2008 or 2005. This is very useful for being a software designer, and I hope you enjoy my video. I'm out.